Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. It's Kaylin Alex. If you're new here, welcome. Go ahead and subscribe. And if you're returning, thank you so much for tuning in. So guys, it is the official holiday countdown. We are in the rush of getting last minute gifts and just getting gifts just in general. It's that time, it's that season. We, we are, we're here. <laughs> so I wanted to give you guys a few alternatives for maybe last minute gifts, stocking stuffers, or if you need a gift, you know, for an extra gift to go up under the Christmas tree. I thought I'd give you guys a few items that we haven't already mentioned. Um, some of my favorite things to give during this time are holiday gift sets. I love, love, love the um, holiday packaging that we get around this time every year. I look forward to it every year, seeing the different packaging and the designs that we get with the holiday collection is literally one of my favorite times of the year. One of my favorite brands that I look forward to every year is Dior. I love their holiday gift sets. If you guys can remember, last year I ended up giving away one of their holiday sets to a subscriber um, as a thank you. And that's just how much I love these. Every year I look forward to them. Every year I get several packages from them. So this year is no different. I feel like Dior is one of those brands that just gets it right with the packaging every single year. It is literally what I look forward to the most. And the contents that's inside of the package just makes it even more better. They have so many different gift sets, such a variety of different options based on the person, their needs, what they may like, what they may want. I'm here for it, okay? So this year is no different. Dior has kindly sponsored this video and sent me over some goodies, which I am so excited to unbox with you guys. This is one of the holiday gift sets. Look at the packaging, y'all. This is why, this is what I look forward to every year. Like this just sitting under the tree, like it's already beautifully packaged and wrapped. I don't have to do anything besides put it under the tree and open it or gift it to someone to put under the tree and then they open it, you know? It's perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. It's like I don't even wanna open it. Like look. Okay, so let's just open it. So I'm gonna show you guys what is in this one. So we have several items. We have a blush set. This is the Rouge Blush. We have the Dior Iconic Mascara, which I have used and loved, so I now have another one. We're here for it. <laughs> this is the Altier of Dreams, what is this? Uh, eyeshadow palette, yep. This is an eyeshadow palette with five shades in it. Then we have a uh, nail polish. Okay, so this is a nail polish in Poppy. And then we have, what is this one? A liquid lipstick. How cute. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and open i'm gonna go ahead and open the packages so you can see what's inside oh my god look at this y'all this is the um lipstick packaging it is oh it's a beautiful burnt orange kind of color i don't know if you got it looks a little red on camera but it is like a deep orange well I, I would say it's more of a red with some orange in it i definitely see hints of orange in it so really pretty this is the oh, i live what this is the uh nail polish it is in a beautiful red color i am just so here for this packaging like look at this guys so beautiful i'm actually gonna open this and it's showing up lighter on camera because of my lights but it's actually like it's like a true red look at this gorgeous i actually cannot wait to use this and this is the eyeshadow palette, super pretty colors. And it also comes with two um, little brushes to apply it. We're here for that. And then this is the mascara, such a beautiful package. This is why I look forward to it every year. It's like the go-to place for me for gift giving, especially with the beauty sets. I'm just here for it. So as you can see, the set is absolutely stunning. Every one that I have gotten each year has been 
no short of amazing I love it I'm here for it so I'm gonna leave a link down below for you guys to shop this set as well as other sets so you can see all of the different varieties of gift sets that they have available and hopefully you can find one that works best for you and who you're looking to buy something for okay so I am actually getting ready to go to an event so we're gonna do a full glam get ready with me we're gonna do makeup and full outfit look for you guys so let's just go ahead and jump into the video all right so to start off I'm going to use my foundation because that's the way I like to go so let me go ahead and put this on I figured I'd give you guys some last-minute gift ideas in case you um, are on a time crunch you forgot about someone or if you just need some extra some extra gifts you know how to go up under the, the tree or stocking stuffers because I think these things will work as stocking stuffers as well so I tried to curate a little list of things that are, you know, that people would appreciate that could be neutral and, but still enjoyable, if that makes sense. I'm gonna go in with my concealer under the eye. So the first thing, as I've already mentioned, that I'm gonna suggest are gift sets. Beauty gift sets are so great, especially for a person who is really into beauty and also people who really aren't or don't know how to shop for beauty items who don't typically do it. These are good ways, you know, to introduce them to new products or a person who like collects different beauty items. This is also great for them. I also love beauty sets because it's usually a collection of items that are new or like new to the person so they can try out different items without having to buy you know the full size versions now I also they can double as great travel accessories a lot of times I'll get the gift sets of perfumes and things like that and this isn't even just for the holidays it's just in general and I'll use those items to travel with instead of taking my full you know perfumes or my full lotions or you know creams or things like that I'll just take the gift set travel size version of it and going about my day and the Dior beauty sets they come with different um, there are different versions that I know I've seen from my own experience before this video um, and they come with some of them have like a lipstick collection which is one of my favorite ones that I've seen recently that, well this holiday season um, and then this one has the the uh, blush eyeshadow lipstick nail polish mascara so pretty much all that you would need to create a makeup look with the exception of like foundation but that's just one thing you basically have everything else that you need to include and i love that another great gift idea would be jewelry <laughs> it's like a no-brainer it's one of the easier <laughs> things to get because there's such a everyone loves jewelry like I think I'm gonna venture to say you can't go wrong with jewelry <laughs> now it doesn't have to be fine jewelry of course that's always nice but but there can be I know a lot of fashion jewelry is really nice and cute is very on trend and for a person who collects jewelry or accessories this would be perfect um not that it just limits it to those people but it's bomb now some of the items that i've seen that have been super cute um i saw a pair of balenciaga earrings that are like hoops and just have like the beads on the inside that are kind of like um they're not it's like a small hoop, so it's not super in your face. I just think they're so cute. I also saw uh, some earrings, and I'll just pop up pictures of the ones that I'm talking about because I'm kind of going off my memory of what I've been saving to my different wish list. <laughs> um, different items that aren't like mainstream um, brands, you know what I mean? Like the big fashion houses, like some of the smaller brands I see come out with some very cute accessories I know uh, Alexandra Rich 
has really really cute accessories really cute earrings that i have seen that are like perfect for even the holidays if you're trying to get something that the person could you know use now yeah i think jewelry is always a great idea <laughs> It's a, a plus, a bigger plus, if it is fine jewelry because it is something that is going to last forever and ever. Now, that is also kind of like one of those things where some costume or fashion jewelry can last a long time. But, I mean, it's no comparison to fine jewelry. That's just that. <laughs> also, I saw a pair of Louis Vuitton earrings that were, they had like the small LV logo in the shape of a heart like the logo was it was a heart earring with the logo in the inside and I thought those were super cute um I would even say those would make a good Valentine's Day gift just because of the heart shape of it I just think they were so cute and dainty and they're not as chunky as the um Louise I think it's the Louise is that the name I think it's the Louise um earrings um but they're still cute in is it's still a vibe you know what i mean the next little item that i have on my list are sunglasses now this can be a <laughs> trickier suggestion because i've seen a lot of people say that they don't keep up with sunglasses and i'm just like why not like what are you doing <laughs> i love like i say this all the time i love a nice pair of sunglasses I just feel like they set a look off and just bring the vibe. It pulls everything together. It's one of those items that helps pull the whole look together. So I have a nice little sunglass collection. I like to shop sunglasses from different places, especially some of my favorite brands. And I feel like they would make a great gift for a person who you know will appreciate them and keep up with them. Now, if you if you know for a fact that the person that you're gifting these to is not going to keep up with them, do not get them sunglasses. Like, do not take this recommendation. Keep it moving. <laughs> but if you're confident that the person will not only keep up with them but appreciate them, I, ha I highly recommend it and I suggest it. Um, just because... It's an easy gift as well. And most of the things that I have on this list are easy gifts. It depends on the style of the person too because that's going to determine which shape of sunglass they prefer most. But there's literally so many different options and different choices and a wide range of sunglasses that there's literally a pair for everybody. <laughs> everybody who enjoys them and wants them, they're there. So now I'm going to go in with blush wow i have makeup all over my nails <laughs> that's cute and i don't really like to go too crazy with blush because it's just not my vibe but it definitely brings a little dimension to the flat face after you know <laughs> all of these other products so the next item i have on my list is going to be for a specific type of person they are passports i think this is such a cool idea these are great accessories for those who you know enjoy traveling um and they're not just limited to or my suggestion isn't just limited to the luxury fashion houses you can even get something from say etsy or someone to customize it to make it a little bit more personal for the person uh and i just feel like that is a very good idea if you know the person enjoys traveling and they're often using their passport it's just it's that extra touch and that extra extra level of thoughtfulness with the gift. It's kind of like, wow. Um, I also think this is super cool for a couple who is newlywed, a newlywed couple who are traveling. Uh, I've seen some that say like Mr. and Mrs. Those are great. You can even get a, a person's initials or their names customized on them and I just think these are so perfect for a person who you know like to travel. Now sticking with the travel theme, I'm going to suggest some luggage. Now this doesn't have to be big luggage or crazy expensive luggage. Um, I'm thinking more along the lines of like an overnight bag, a duffel bag, a small carry-on type luggage. If you know the person travels a lot, basically, yeah, they travel a lot or they'll, you know, get a lot of use out of it. This is another great gift idea. I have seen these small little off-white carry-ons on 
a lot of promotion so you can get those easily i think they are super cute and these aren't that expensive at all again price is going to be relative to the person but for the item and for the luxuriness of the item i think it's more attainable than some so those are great ideas as well as duffel bags or backpack i think backpacks are so are such a great gift for a guy who likes to travel because i mean us women we can use our different handbags and totes but i think a backpack for a male is definitely a great idea other great luggage from actual luggage companies are uh, Remoa, Remoa, and uh, Tumi. I love Tumi luggage. We actually have some, and I just feel like they are such great quality and nice, classic luxury, luxurious travel pieces. Um, I y'all know how I feel about. <laughs> Y'all know how I feel about the Louis Vuitton luggage. I've had it, I've had my, my time with it, especially like the roll-on cases. I have checked them in at one point, and of course they got damaged and had to be replaced. So ever since then, and this happened like when I was younger, ever since then I've just never bought any more um, luxury luggage in that sense. And because I don't really care for the attention that it draws in the airport. Okay, so now I'm just going to take my contour powder and use it as an eyeshadow over my lid. This is just to like bring a little color to my lid so it's just not bare. Although I do wear it bare quite a bit. Now the last thing that I have on my list, something great for a person or a couple or a family who's just moved into a home or newlywed or birthday gifts. This isn't just limited to the holiday time. These are just great gifts. They can even be just great just because gifts, okay? So it's gonna be glassware. And not just any old glassware, some nice exquisite glassware. Now, some of my favorite glassware is from Baccarat. I love me some Baccarat, you know, glassware, especially as a gift because I feel like it just screams, you know, thought, elegance, and luxury in home design and decor. I'm just here for it. They have, and if the person that, if you know the person and likes to, you know, have a glass of wine or likes to drink, you know, here and there, these are great. Glasses are really nice and a nice quality, of course. You're going to pay for the quality, okay? <laughs> but the packaging, everything just like screams a vibe. Like, I just love it. It's one of my favorite things to give. Um, Tiffany also has really great uh, gift sets. They even have sets for glassware and I think they have a little bit more than just the drinking glasses because they have I think tableware and things like that even like the bar utensils and tools that you need to make a drink at a bar I think those are great especially if you know the person doesn't mind um those type of things bomb looks great on the shelf they're great for hosting parties and celebrations um i even found some nice glassware from z gallery that i bought maybe like a few years ago maybe two or three years ago and they're just like the champagne flutes and you they're in they're not they're like a little stem so they're great for when you're hosting a party and it doesn't have to be alcoholic like it could be non-alcoholic beverages in the glasses as well we're just all for the aesthetic of it you know um you can also get some glasses that are tiffany and maybe have someone uh put an initial or engrave them have them um customized with the couple's initial or something like that i think those are perfect and great gifts they're thoughtful and they just shows that you put a little more effort into it rather than just buying something like you know boring if that makes sense 
So I went ahead and finished my makeup off camera. I just applied my lashes and did my lipstick. I'm gonna pop in somewhere here <laughs> the full look I have on my, um, this hot pink blazer that I got from Nasty Gal that you guys should have seen me um, speak about in my recent clothing haul with some Abercrombie, um, they're like vegan leather pants with my Amina Muwadi shoes and then just a Zara um, cami underneath and we're gonna be out the door and ready to go to the event so that's gonna be it for this video guys I will have a link down below for you guys to shop the Dior products thank you again for Dior for sponsoring this video um, don't forget to like drop a nice comment down below subscribe hit the notification bell so you get a notification when I post again and I will see you in the next video